Uh, Sherry Kawasan, good to have you with us. Uh, tell me, what's your assessment right now of the Japanese economy? Well, I think the um, um, economy remains uh, quite weak, um, not necessarily uh, recovering much from the uh, damages to the um, uh, Tohoku area uh, and Kanto area because of the uh, from the earthquake. Um, the production activities remain quite uh, stagnant because of the still uh, companies are suffering from the so-called uh, you know um, supply chain disruption problems. Uh, power problem has become a bit smaller than expected, but uh, still, you know, uh, we tend to think that our power shortage is going to be a big issue in, in summer. Consumption has uh, declined a lot in March, and uh, consumption uh, has, uh, you know, le has remained uh, fairly weak. Uh, maybe starting in June, some recovering consumption, but uh, still, you know, many people are concerned about the job outlook because of this uh, earthquake and uh, negative ramification in production activities. So we do not anticipate any major pick in consumption in summer. Uh, corporate activities remain fairly weak in terms of the investment, um, but uh, we have seen some pickup in demand for machineries uh, because some companies now want to increase um, their production right. capacity, mainly because of the damage to their machines uh, because of the tsunamis. So some uh, temporary demand for capital expenditure by companies, but not necessarily that strong to offset the weakness of right. uh, consumption. Okay, Shirakawa-san, you're saying that Japan's economy faces strong downward pressure in the short term at least, but uh, we might see a moderate recovery from the second half of fiscal 2011. So when you say moderate, you know, what kind of growth are we looking at considering we had a contraction of 3.7% in the previous quarter? Yeah, well, we had a very significant decline in Q1, down 3.7% Q by Q. Uh, we anticipate slight negative Q by Q growth in Q2, um, but, but GDP will be turning positive um, somewhat in July, September quarter, and maybe mm -hmm. some acceleration into the end of the year, uh, mainly okay, because you know, the public investment and uh, pickup in production, consumption recovery. But our concern yeah. relates to next year because the, okay. we are not anticipating any major sustained uh, uh, you know, demand source into next year. So um, after some, you know, the temporary boost uh, from government investment uh, phase, I think the uh, next year's growth is not necessarily that high. I mean, many expect 3% growth next year, but we tend to expect maybe only 2% next year. Yeah, uh, you know, corporates are also concerned about next year as well, Shirokawa, including Panasonic, saying that their uh, fiscal 2012 uh, levels and earnings looks uh, extremely severe in their words. Thanks for sharing your thoughts today, Shirokawa, always a, a pleasure to have you.